Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. Oh, this? This is just one of the many random things I picked up in today's haul. So let's check it out. Yo, so today I went to a private sale, got to get whatever I wanted, setting up for a garage sale in a few weeks, but I found them early. They told me to come on over and have a look, so I did. So here's a look at the things that I picked up. Some good stuff in here. Again, I'm probably not going to tell you the price, but if you want to guess the overall amount, you can put it in the comments. All right, let's go. First thing that you just saw. It is a vintage Disneyland, Disney World back scratcher, apparently. It is vintage, though. It is Disneyland, Walt Disney World on the back, designed and made for Disney World. So that's pretty cool. Burger King. That's right, Burger King. Lord of the Rings. Fellowship of the Ring. A Legolas. Little figure in here. That's pretty cool. Nothing too crazy. But it is pretty cool. I have no idea what they're worth or their value, but it's Lord of the Rings. Uh, I found this vintage original Pink Floyd off the wall cassette tape. Um, I gave it a little clean, so it's in pretty good condition now, as you can see. Um, if anybody knows anything about me, they know I'm a huge Randy Orton fan. Um, I found this. I don't think I have it for my loose collection. Um, it was in box, but the box was heavily damaged. So I just picked it up anyway. Now it's mint and loose. Bang, bang. I know I say bang, bang a lot, and I don't know why, and I can't stop saying it. It might become the phrase without becoming the phrase because it became the phrase, you know? Um, I found three of these, three different ones, so we could go through them. These are from... 1979 again Walt Disney I'm just if you've watched the other videos you know I'm a huge Disney lover so these are um, unpunched matchbox cars Walt Disney there's Minnie Mouse there there's Donald look at him in his little Jeep so cool Pinocchio Pinocchio I mean Pinocchio. Yes. The little jester car at the back. Looks pretty cool. Anything vintage Disney, I'm just like, you know. I found this vintage PlayStation case. Pretty cool. PlayStation 1 holds the discs inside. So that, I thought that was pretty cool. As I am a PlayStation lover. Um, I'm not going to take them out, but I will show you the top card. This is the entire 1995 Flair, Flair, Spider-Man set. The whole base set, I should say. 150 cards. That is the main card. That is number one. That's a sick card too, but yeah, that's the entire set. I didn't know what I was getting when I got it. It just I saw a couple Spider-Man cards. I saw the whole thing. I'm like, I'm just going to take a shot. And um, the the shot paid off because, oh my god, get it. Because it is the entire base set, which is pretty awesome. Now, this is pretty cool. They have the game, Time Crisis Project Titan by Namco on PS1. Not just the game. Trigger seems pretty fine. It's not stuck or anything. So I thought that was a pretty good get. I cleaned it up as well, as you can see. It's pretty, pretty good condition. So... Shout out to my craftsmanship of just being able to wipe dirt off. I know, right? The difficult stuff. Why am I? I think I shrunk. I mean, I'm pretty small anyway, but let me get back up. Found these, right? Going off the, the PlayStation stuff. We have a PS2 Slim. This is one version of it. Found that. But we don't stop there. Bang. I said bang again. PS2 Slim. Another version. As you can see, the tops are different. I thought it was a fake to begin with, but then I did some research and realized that it is not. They did indeed make these two different versions. 
And then just to, you know, get the granddaddy of them all. Oh, the OG big fella. Another PS2. All for very good prices. That's why I got them all in great condition. Um, I tested them all. They are all working, which is great given their age. So, yeah. Basically, anything vintage, Disney, and old school PlayStation, I'm just like <laughs> in there. I'm all up in there. So, uh, what can I say? It is what it is. I really wanted them and I got them. Um, cleaned them up. They're all in pretty good condition, too. So, but they were some great gets. There is some accessories as well, like some controllers and one or two games that came with a lot, but like, you don't need to see that. You don't need to see that. I've rambled on long enough. So that is the haul I got today. If you want me to do more haul video, haul, haul, haul videos, and or know people that are selling vintage stuff that you think I like, send them my way. Or send me their way. And I'll be here seeing if you can hit that nostalgia button in your brain and be like, damn, I remember that. Or damn, that's cool. Because, you know, I'm just here showing off dumb shit. And if you like it, you like it. And that's even better. So, I guess I will maybe kind of... You're kind of cute. So maybe I'll, I'll see you again sometime. Bye.